Mama, what is it? What is the meaning of this now? Mama, what is it? What is what? What are you trying to do? Mama, I want to slide down and sleep now. What is it? <laughs> sleep with your husband or your wife, if I may ask. I don't understand. What do you mean by that? Mm, you don't understand. Go in bed and sleep with Boniface. Boniface is your husband. Go in there and sleep with Boniface and the wife. Boniface is not my husband. He's marrying two wives as far as I'm concerned. Oh, I'm just a side chief. Why don't you understand this? Boniface is not my husband. Watch your mouth. Just say yourself. You are a side chick. So you are good for on bed. But for, you are not good for marriage. Eh? You are good on bed. You are not good for marriage. As far as I'm concerned, Boniface is your husband. Go in there and stay with him. Bro, I can't sleep with him. I can't go in there and sleep with him. Can't you see he's sleeping with his wife? Eh? Don't allow me to sleep here now. What is it now? You can. You can. If I can help you, let me show you how you can. Mama, wait. Wait, 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 she said everything that she eats is what I eat. And everything that she eats, we almost wear the same clothes there. This woman takes care of me. Eh? Now I'm carrying this fire here now because of this woman. Yet you want me to treat her bad. I cannot do it, Mama. I can't understand me now, please. You wear the same bra, eh? You wear the same pants, eh? You will marry the same husband. Mama, I'm wait now. Go there. Go there. Don't ever come to the side of me. This woman treats you good. You wear the same head, you wear the, you wear the same pants and share the same husband with her. Rubbish. You like her? What is it? It is my mother. She threw me out. So I should go and sleep with the bony face. Don't worry, I hear everything. But why is your mom this difficult? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know what is wrong with that. Eh? I've tried to calm her down to explain everything to her, but she will not listen. Eh? Now she threw me out in the night. How am I going to? Where will I sleep? Eh? Can I can't sleep here alone. Eh? What will I do? Okay, hold on. Hmm. I can't sleep here alone. Eh? I can't sleep here alone. You know it's night. You can't yeah. stay alone. I'm scared. I can't sleep alone. Okay, oh, I'll have that. Let's lie down together. Okay. Thank you. Why are you lying down here with her? Honey boy, you heard everything. You heard everything going on between her and her mother. Yes. What did you just say? Between her and her mother. What is going on between her and her mother is none of your business. So why, why you, am I going to stay here alone? Oh honey, she cannot stay here alone now. Let me stay here and keep her company. Please. She, she cannot stay there alone. Why? Can, can I stay alone on my own? But I know you can stay alone. Please, honey. Please. Uh, excuse me. Mama. Mama, open this door for your daughter to come in and lie down. For what? Let her come in and lie down. It's, it's, it's cold out there and it's night already. Let her lie down with you. Let her sleep with the husband. I'm not the husband. What do you mean by that? I'm not married to your daughter. Let her come and lie down with you. Husbands are meant to lie down with their wives, not with their mother. Please, I've sent her out to go and sleep with you. 
Let her sleep in between you and your wife. She is your wife. Mama, why are you making things difficult for everybody in this house? Please, open the door for her. Please, I beg of you. Please, I'm not the husband. Let her go and sleep with the husband. You are disturbing me for crying out loud. Why is this woman so difficult? Why is she difficult? Honey, I don't know. I don't know. I don't, I don't even know what to do to her or what to do with her. I think we are going to settle this once and for all. I have my plans. Things are working out already the way I plan them. I'm going to settle this with everybody. We are, we are going to have a meeting here tomorrow morning. I'm going to first settle this once and for all. <laughs> I wish everything can just go back to normal. Eh? What's all this? Um, please. I want us to listen. Everybody listen. Because I want to bring a lasting solution to all these crises in this house. For Christ's sake, are we the only people living in this neighborhood? Are we the only people living in this compound? Every morning, afternoon, night, there will be noise coming out of this house. Out of this flat. Now, because of this, to bring sanity and for peace to reign, I have made a decision. And not just decision, I have started taking, carrying out the plans. Um, please, Mama. Since that, I mean, since you came to this house, it has been from one issue to the other. And I'm not happy about that. Please. It is clear to me that there is no how or whatever anybody can do that will make all of us to stay in peace. The only way to solve this problem is for us to do one thing and that is you and your daughter. We have to leave. What am I saying? I have paid for a place, a flat, a very comfortable and well furnished flat. Two bedroom flat for you and your daughter. A very good place in town. I have paid for that. Well equipped. Food items and everything is in the house. The best thing for us to do right now is for you and your daughter to leave this house. Pack in there. Stay there. I will make sure that you are well taken care of. Until the child is delivered. Even after that. I, I, thought I am going to make sure that the house is paid for. Even if it's four or five years. I will pay for it. So that you, you, you have peace. And me and my wife will have peace. It is very important. So that I, I am losing it. So that peace will reign in this house, please. That is all I have to say, Mama. If you have anything to say, you can say. Boniface, you lied. You sure are she? How can you bond me and my daughter to another building? Or to somewhere else? You must marry my daughter. My daughter is your side chick. Me, I'm your side mother, our side mother, you know, our side mama. I don't care. We cannot leave this car, house. All of us will live here together as one family. She is not going anywhere. No, no, no. Stand up. No, Kabi, man. Stand up, stand up, stand up. Go and possess your possession. Go there. Excuse me, excuse me. Ah! Stay here. This is your house, henceforth. Boniface is getting married to two wives, and that is all. They are taking us to another building. <laughs> As far as I'm concerned, my daughter belongs to this family. Simple. Go to another place where yeah, you will rent house for us. Rubbish. Listen, you have to talk to Ineka. You really, really have to talk to Ineka. This is the only way to bring sanity to this house. They'll have to leave. 
I've made all the arrangements. They have to leave. You cost this. Mm -hmm. the, the, all these things that is happening in this house, you cost it. If you had kept this thing in between your legs, one place, eh? This, all these things, this hell I'm seeing in this house called marriage, it wouldn't have been happening. But you refused to keep this thing listen, one place. Listen, are we here to stop blaming ourselves for, for what has happened or to find a solution to this? Whatever. You need to talk to Neka. Forget about all these things you are talking about. It has happened, it has happened. Talk to Neka to talk to her mother. They need to leave this house. I am losing it. Please. <sighs> Neka, I don't know why your, your mother is proving stubborn or I don't know, I don't even know what to call it. Eh? The plans my husband has towards you, ah, it's okay. I know my husband, he will not do anything to hurt you. So as far as I am involved, he has said that I'm involved in your case, he will not do you any harm. Eh? He rented a very nice place. Everything is available. Everything you ever want is there. I will even make sure that everything is there. So why don't you, your mother want you to go there? Eh? Why? I don't understand. Why? Why is she causing more trouble in my home? Or should I regret ever bringing you into this house? Auntie, yeah, please don't talk like that. Don't. Or oh, better still, should I push you guys out? Is it better? Please, Auntie, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything that my mother has done. I will try and reason with her. I will talk to her. Eh? Please do. I'll talk to her. Let me Please. know if she can. She, you need to talk to her. Okay. This one, she's telling you to, to, to do this, to do that, to take over. The... There is nothing you can do to take over my home. I am here, I am here. There is nothing you can do. No, not you, not her. No, nobody can do anything to take me out of this place. Even if she she succeeded in, in, in taking away my baby, it would have still made you a wife in this home. So I will talk it to won't. Her. I will reason with her again. Although I've been trying to explain to her, but don't worry. I will reason with her. I will reason with her again. Please do, because it's getting out of hand. I, I don't find it funny anymore. I welcomed her when she came into this house. I am not supposed to, but I did. I welcomed you. I welcomed your mom because I loved you. And I love her too. But she's 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 really taking it another way that I don't understand. Please. Talk to her. I'm begging you. Your senses. Really shut up your mouth. Eh? You want to remain a side chick forever. Eh? Well, I'm doing it for your own good. And you will not see it. No, you will not see it. You are blindfolded. What do I say? You are blindfolded. My daughter, please say God forbid. Say God forbid. God forbid. They will marry you here. God forbid for us to leave this facility. Eh? For another woman, for your second to take over. Boniface must marry you. Boniface must marry you as far as I'm concerned. Listen. Mama, I have spoken to you in a gentle way that you, it seems you, ref, you, you don't want to listen. Your daughter has spoken to you, but you failed to listen. I am here to still gently talk to you because I don't want to take it in a measure that you will not like it. You have to leave this house with your daughter. I have paid for a place five years. I have paid. You have to leave this house. Please. Do you understand what I'm saying? No. <laughs> You want us to leave? Yes. You want us to leave? Yes. Only on one condition. Condition? So what, what, what is the condition? Money. Money? 10 million naira. What? Plus a car. What? A car is not an America. A cheap for that matter. You will give us gardener. Security. Cleaner. Cook. Driver. As we have paid five years for the house. We are paying them five years each of them with the sum of 10 million naira cash. What do you and a cheap sound one, not ordinary car? What do you expect me to get that kind of money? 10 million naira from where? 
and pay all this help. Five. You listed, I paid them for five, five years. What do, what do you expect me to get that, that kind of money? Listen, I have seen that you don't want to make things easy for everybody. You don't want to make things easy for me or for anybody in this house. But I assure you one thing. Whatever you're looking for, I will give it to you hundred folds. Leave my house. Leave my house. I was, I'm selling it again. Leave my house. Now, if you cannot meet up to that expectation, you will marry my daughter or you must marry my daughter. We are not going anywhere. When you cannot pay the cook, the security man, the cleaner, the gardener, even the, the driver, give us a very sound, sound jeep that has a name, branded jeep, with the sum of 10 million naira. We are not living. You will go and pay my daughter's right price. Let us stay and enjoy. If you cannot meet up to that expectation, simple. House of the Sun's Global, where we can feel it.